So here today, we got something pretty cool. We got Anchor's kit. For some reason, Global hasn't tweeted yet. I don't know if they're they're sleeping or taking a nap or doing something, but we do have Anchor's kit. So I'll share Anchor's kit with you here today. Uh, we don't know when Helm or Anissa's kit will drop, but right now we have Anchor's, but let's, let's jump into it. If you're new to the channel, like and subscribe, helps out a ton. Let's check it out and let's see what's happening. So this is the video. And because of this video, we also have an idea of what's happening with the other two characters. Again, this is more so speculation, so just don't quote me on this, but it is a lot of people that are confirming this and telling me that this most likely is the case just to make sure. So I'm not like, uh, completely wrong uh, i fact checked a lot of people so hopefully this is correct but first we have anchor over here this is what her idle animation looks like we kind of already saw it yesterday but that's there we have this over here being her shooting animation it's a rocket launcher user keep that in mind which again it could be good but remember she is an sr character so i don't expect like too too much from her but she could be good still she could be good um so moving forward we do in fact have yes the rotation you gotta always have the rotation when it's a showcase they're going to milk the uh, the Anise and uh, Helm uh, shake, if you will, right? But there we go. We have this also over here uh, showing us we have Helm, we have Anise, we have Litter, and we have Mast. So burst one, a burst two, um, a burst one. That means that we're going to be left with a burst two and a burst three over here. That most likely is the case because of all the speculation that's been going around. Like there's an explanation, which I don't want to give like the long form of it, but you hear the burst over here at the end. Once the full burst occurs, that is Helm's voice, which is the very end, which means that most likely she is the burst three. That leaves her to be the burst two, correct? That is kind of the format they're going for here. So Anise does seem to be the burst two, and it seems like Helm is the burst three. Again, don't quote me on that. It could be the other way around. But right now, after all the talking we kind of got through, uh, all the people that kind of told me this, uh, it's burst two and burst three. So again, Helm is a burst three. This is a burst two. It does suck. A lot of people were hoping that she wasn't a burst three, and Helm is apparently a burst three, which we don't know. How do we know that she's a burst one? Because we have the kit right here. That's a burst one right there. Uh, so do keep that in mind. But continuing onwards, we do in fact get to see her burst and everything like that. Um, so you can kind of take a look at this in a second. This is the burst over here. Again, showing you burst one, obviously, if you didn't know. That's the burst animation. Very basic, very simple. Uh, and it also looks like over here, her ammo drops. So only her ammo count drops, nobody else it looks like. Yeah, only her ammo count drops. So it looks like maybe some uh, kind of alt thing that she has drops her um, kind of count there. Remember, she has to allow um, some sort of thing, buff, right? To where her team can actually reset um, or rather burst more often. That's there. So that's what her kit kind of uh, entails here. We kind of know that she's going to buff Electric Code, right? So again, the team here is not like an ideal team anyway, because again, obviously the other characters here are not Electric Code, um, but that's what it does look like. So just keep this in mind. But her her number here, her, her ammo capacity drops, and you have to also look at it. Look how fast she reloads her ammo. So keep that in mind that she's like on par with, I would say, Noir uh, or Sugar and how fast they reload uh, Sugar when she when she bursts, right? Because look at this, right? It's just, it's instantly reloaded in a way. Let me rewind it real quick. Um, look at that. <laughs> Completely, really fast. I'll loop it real quick just so I have it. But look at this, ready? Boom. Just like that, done and ready to go. So she does have a fast reload time. We kind of also uh, understand that there. So do keep that in mind, but that is pretty cool to see. Um, that's kind of what we got. So we kind of have the idea again, burst three and a burst two. Um, I've talked to a crap ton of people and we all kind of come up, uh, came up with that as the solution or the idea. So do keep that in mind. And again, it's the team that they're currently running. Uh, don't look at that uh, too in depth, but that's there. We do have the translation over here. I'll use my phone to translate it first, uh, but I will let you enjoy with this for a few seconds. Again, this is a very like iffy. This is why I want to show it to you, but it's a very iffy um, translation. So don't expect too much from it. All right. It's going to be incorrect in some areas. It's not going to be too accurate. So please just keep that in mind. All right. Just make sure that is uh, abundantly clear. Okay. But we'll continue onwards with it and just translate the other stuff here um, to kind of see what they um, they kind of kind of do here. Let's see. So this is going to be um, all right. Let's see. First type defensive character. We know that burst skill is going to be one. So keep that in mind. Also, the weapon is a rocket launcher. Code is wind. Keep that in mind. Also, it says when the last bullet hits the target, taunt maintained for five seconds. When the last bullet hits self, her self defense goes up by twenty three percent, and that is maintained for five seconds. That attack is going to be called the first one, right? Um, oh, it just says GS. That's her passive, okay? Skill two, it says, and that's not a passive, but whatever. Uh, skill two is this. It is going to be at the start of the battle. When attacking an enemy projectile, uh, damage dealt to the projectile increases by 25.6% continuously. So that's what that says. For this last one over here, the burst skill is a cooldown of 20 seconds. You can read that kind of. So all enemies, final attack power, 304%. That's it. So it's a very basic kit, nothing too special here. And it looks like this is kind of actually very accurate. Maintains for five seconds. When the last bullet hits um, to self, the defense goes up. So a very, very simple kit here. Nothing too special. It's an SR character. We kind of expected that, correct? 
Um, and it looks like, did they just did they just retweet that? <laughs> Nikkei finally tweeted, right? And what they tweeted was they accidentally deleted or they purposely deleted um, Helm's entire a video because there was something apparently shown in there that they weren't supposed to, uh, I guess, show. So they did in fact retweet it. Something important. You already saw that. I already kind of made a video on it. Uh, it's just that profile thing. Nothing of kit or anything like that. Uh, so keep that in mind, okay? But um, yeah, that's what the kit looks like. And again, it's what we kind of got from this entire trailer here, showing this uh, this character off. Um, it looks like, it, personally, it does make sense, verse 3, verse 2. Um, and again, with what their kit is, there is some information floating around, which I don't want to trust yet. If we do trust that information, we're all screwed. But if, if that information is incorrect, we're, we're TMW. Because that information is putting her kit in a very, very niche area. Like, literally a very niche area. Um, so both characters will be extremely niche, okay? Now, again, I don't want to say too much, right? Because I, I don't know if this leak is correct. If it is correct, we're screwed. But it's it's putting both characters in such a niche area where people are already panicking that it's like uh, don't summon in the like, Doom post thing. Uh, so I don't want to say too much on that. I don't know too much uh, because we, we can't guarantee what the leak says, right? So we'll have to wait for the official kit. Um, and again, Global has not tweeted for some reason. Only we have this tweet over here for the uh, untranslated version. I don't know why Global wasn't tweeting, um, but it's been hours. I've waited hours to bring this to you. It's four hours late. Um, because I was like, maybe they'll tweet, because I want like the translation. But again, it the only reason I came through with it, just uh, drop it now, it's because this translation is so bare. <laughs> There's literally nothing in it, dog. Taunt, five seconds. When the last bullet hits, increase the self by five seconds. That's it, or maintains for five seconds. At the start of the battle, um, what is it? When attacking an enemy projectile, the uh, damage dealt to the projectile increases by 25% continuously. To all enemies, final attack power, 304%. Uh, 0.45 uh, percent damage, right? And then it cooldown to 20 seconds. So that's there. Burst one, by the way. Again, it, pu it pushes these two as burst three, burst two. She has something with her kit that lowers her am ammo count. Um, she does reload very fast, though. We kind of see that now. Um, we don't see too much beyond that. Do we see anything beyond that? I don't think we have a burst skill over here. Is there anything shown? Um, doesn't look like it. Let me see. Someone told me to like slow this down here, and I might see something. So I'm just curious. Are they, are they being honest or not? Let's see. Oh, no, they're capping hard. They're capping hard. They said that you can see Anissa's uh, animation here. But yes, this is uh, this is future Gogo here. I cut out this whole segment of the video because I wanted to share this with you. Someone did, in fact, send me this. Um, and this, or rather, sent this somewhere and I found it. Um, but this is, in fact, going to be why it's being said. Because you have over here... Um, this is her burst animation transitioning. As I was saying in this segment, I'm like, oh no, I don't see it. It's because apparently they've deleted it or it's just very, very, like a, a split second, which I can get for you. But you can see it right here. This is Anissa's leg right here, Anissa's leg right there. And then her clothing on the top there and her jacket, you can see the yellow marks. That is clearly Anise. So if Anise is popping up right after her animation and she's a burst one, this is why people have established the fact that she is a burst two. And that is why Helm is the burst three. Because at the end, when you hear every uh, sound effect play, her sound effect is the last sound effect because she's the final burst. So her sound effect will play last, correct? So all the information does add up. That means, again, in a quick little confirmation, burst one over here, Anise is a burst two, and Helm is a burst three. So they're filling up every single slot for this event. So do keep that in mind. It looks like that is the case. Now confirmed, just so you know, confirmed, because that is literally why that's there. Um, so burst two, burst three, what do you think? Are you hyped or not? Let me know. With that, I'll catch you in the next one. Have fun, stay safe.